What's going on everyone? It is going on 7.30 a little late. Making a video today, but um, I got a new charger, so that's thumbs up right there. I'm actually gonna pull up a few pieces of my tin right now as I'm talking to you guys. Oh, I thought it was something. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna find anything. There should be a few ringnecks out and about. Um, out and about, under 10, but we'll see. But anyways, like I said, I got a new charger. So that's great. And um, tomorrow, if all goes well, I'm gonna go over and lay out some tin and also explore more and do some uh, investigating over there on the property across from ours uh, where I've done a few videos now and found that ring neck under the dryer. Saw something hop there, maybe a little moth. So check this piece here. See if there's anything. And um, I'm gonna check this piece really good. I found a few ring necks. Oh, there's one. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to show it to you guys. Hold on. It's a little guy. There he is. What's up, dude? I think I found him before to put his piece back. But I found like yeah, I found three or four of those guys under there this year. Found a racer under there last year. So that one's produced a little bit. It's kind of on the edge of the property. Back here, neighbor's house is um, back that way. But anyways, yeah, new charger. Also got a new shirt today. I don't know if I'll wear that tomorrow because I'm going to be in the woods and stuff. So, And um, it's very, it's a very bright yellow. So not that that really matters. I mean, you know, being in the woods, but be very easy to spot in general so very easy to spot but doesn't really matter if I'm seen or not there you know people would probably mind their I'm sure they'd mind their own business and go their own way because seeing a large hairy dude in the woods with some tan I'm sure they're not gonna question me <laughs> but um next I'll just move stuff around for the time being over there and I'll film some of it tomorrow and um, see if I can find a few curders, but the main the main thing is you know moving some of that until things get developed, and then like I see uh, doing a little investigating, see what they were doing by that pond, and maybe move some pieces that were already over there. And um, cause I know that there's some. There's like this. Not exactly a pile, it's like a, it's kind of hard to explain, it's sort of a pile, but, and some of it needs to be straightened out, like actual straightened out, like take some pliers or something, so, I don't know, maybe I need to look into that more and see, but y'all will get to see that stuff, and, um, you know, I'll show you everything, and I may ask, you know, suggestions for where people think I should move some of it, and, uh, because I have some ideas on some areas that I, that more tin would be good. And uh, one place already has some tin, which it was the main flip site, but most of it's gone because they had to have a little road for the, um, to get to the pond. So, a lot of that got taken, unfortunately, the really good stuff. But I've still got, I've still got, um, there's still a bit over there. Man, I'm sweating. Got 90 something, it's 90 right now, 63% humidity. Tomorrow it's supposed to be 97, so I've got to figure out what time I'm going to um, put everything out because I don't want to be there midday, over there midday. I'd like to spend all day over there, but it's just not at, not at 97 degrees and I'm not sure what the humidity is going to be. If it's 50, 60%, that alone, I mean, with it, uh, no. I'll, uh, I'll pass on that, but anyways, I'm gonna flip a little bit in. Man, it looks like some more branches or something fell. Maybe I forgot they're there. That's probably what happened. We'll see here. There's no way I can flip all this with one hand. Mm. I don't think like there's anything under here anyways, so that doesn't really matter. All right. Well, guys, um, that's the plan, and tomorrow's should be. Hey, Mr. Briar, leave me alone. 
tomorrow should be pretty good and uh, just got to stay hydrated and make sure I go at the right time and yeah should be decent anyways guys I think I'm gonna end it here there's another stack I could go through but it's hard to go through with one hand and um, anyways thanks for squatching and I'll catch y'all tomorrow hopefully I'll be spreading out some tin maybe find something along the way see you later